come on in. Pizza, pizza, pizza. Not doing Little Caesars. Welcome to the episode 10 of the Spitzer 14 Day Pizza Challenge. I'm Ethan. I'm Jeff. And today's pizza was Marciano's. You'll realize that PJ is not here. He's with his girlfriend right now. I feel a little betrayed that he's with her and not with us. He chose the girl instead of the pizza. Wise decision. I thought the only really good thing about it was the crust. The only good thing about it was the crust? The sauce was eh. The toppings were eh. The quality was bad. The taste was okay. Because it was soft. You love soft crust. I feel like yeah. you say soft I all the time. I hate hard crust. But like crust is usually hard. That's why you don't see me eat it that much. I didn't like the sauce at all, really. I didn't either. It felt like it was like a Cheap. Italian Italian tomato sauce that you find on spaghetti. Yeah, it was a little. It wasn't as red. It was more orangey. The toppings didn't feel like they were on it, like at all. It just felt like there was a lack of it, and it didn't even taste that good. What about? What did you think about the onions? The onions, they're like I had a piece where they're yeah. like like a sausage on cheese, and then they had a huge like stack of onions, not even on cheese. Mm -hmm. And that brings me to my next point, quality. On like almost all the pizzas, the cheese wasn't even on the whole pizza. When I saw you open the box, yeah. I was like, I'm not gonna like it because of how bad it looked. <laughs> it, it, it looked you, bad. If you're showing it right now, that looked bad. That brings me to another point. Check out right here, where the uh, crust is all bent, because the the box yeah. they gave us wasn't even big enough to hold the pizza. So when they close, when they put the pizza in, they closed the box up. The box bent all the crust up because the pizza was too big for the box. Who invented that idea? Marcianos. The taste it's, is like irrelevant now. Now for the pros and cons. Dad, for the pros? The only pro was crust. It was, like Ethan says, soft. Nice and soft. Nice and soft. Ethan, what do you say about the cons? Alright, for the cons! Sauce was terrible. I felt like, like what I said before, it was the tomato sauce of the spaghetti. Acidic! The toppings? Alright, it's kind of complicated, but on a piece, if you wanted sausage and onion on a piece, they were like not mixed together. Like sausage was on one side of the piece and onions were on the other. So you're telling me the guy who or girl who put the toppings on the pizza for every piece put half and half on each piece? Oh, for the pieces I got, yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay, and for the quality. The quality was caused by the box, I think. Yeah. The box kind of like curved up the crust. Yeah. And I mean, it's, it, you think it's not a big deal, but it's a big deal. When you open up the, the box, you want it to be like. Then when you open it up, you saw the crust up, and then the cheese wasn't everywhere. It was just ruined it. Ruined it. And since we both kind of disliked it, we both decided to give it two and a half stars. Tomorrow's pizza is going to be a, a place that we've never been before. I'm not even 100% sure how to pronounce it because I've only seen it spelled. And it's called Pequods, I think. Anyways, it's in Morton Grove and I think there's one in Chicago as well. And apparently everybody says it's super awesome and the internet looks like it's rated really high. So we're gonna drive over there and eat there and see if it's really good like everybody says. Pizza, 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 pizza. Not doing Little Caesars.